Hey, I want to thank my friend Candace. I recently took an assessment called Core Clarity. And I thought it was really interesting. What they do is try to try to drill down to your talents and skills so that you know where the core of you comes from. And what it does, it gives you the top five of all your cores out of 54 things, I believe it was, 54 different topics. So mine were achiever, positivity, belief, input, and focus. And I, I thought it was real inter interesting because we had some time to visit about it and talk about things. And it answered some questions about me. It actually answered some questions of why I um, envision certain people the way they are. So if you don't know what your top five core, these are things that I don't have to focus on. They're there. That's part of me. That's what they call them, the core. They go on. And these are things that have probably been with me since birth. So I find it really interesting when I talk to people and they go, yep, that's you, achiever. Every day I look at going, I have a list and I go through my list and I check it out. That's my number one. Now, my number five thing was focus. And if you put focus and achiever together, oh my gosh, please get out of my way. Hey, if you don't know what they are, look up core uh, coreclarity.org. Go on and check that out. I think there's an assessment you can do for $15 and it gives you a little bit of insight into yourself. There's some great stuff. Anyway, hey, if you don't know who you are, how are you going to treat other people right? How are you going to connect? See, that's the thing. Are we connecting and communicating well enough? And maybe the problem isn't the other person. It could be you. How about that? So when I look in the mirror and I think about the way that I've approached some personalities, uh, hey, it's not them, it's me. So. Hey, go out, have a great day, bump into somebody you don't know, have a conversation, 10secondsdaily.com. I'll talk to you soon.